So my name is Greg Mundus and I am an orthopedic surgeon with subspecialty training in pediatric and adult reconstructive spine surgery. My medical interests uh, are twofold. The first is uh, kids or pediatric patients that have spinal deformities like kyphosis or scoliosis. And the second is the adult counterparts that have similar problems. I started practicing medicine in 2009 and uh, it's been a great ride since then. Uh, and really been enjoying my practice that involves both uh, kids and adults with these spinal deformities. And uh, on a side note, I've been able to be very engaged in research elements throughout these years. Uh, being very fortunate to be part of uh, some large study groups that have had a tremendous impact on our field. Orthopedic spine surgery became a huge passion of mine during my second year in training. And it really came during my, my time I spent on the pediatric service. And during this time, we got to take these kids that would come in with 100 degrees of scoliosis and over the course of six to eight hours treat them and they'd be straight afterwards. And even though the recovery was hard, when we got to see these kids back in the office a month later or three months later and a year later, boy, we really changed their lives and their families saw how their lives were changed and it changed the whole dynamic of the kids and their families. And, and uh, I knew at that point that was exactly what I wanted to do with the rest of my life. So there's a couple different types of surgeries that I specialize in. Uh, predominantly reconstructive, where we use different type of spinal implants to correct the scoliosis or the kyphosis. Depending on the type of problem that there is, we can do this in several different ways. And we have been fortunate to be a part of a lot of thought leaders here in San Diego where we've been able to use minimally invasive surgery to treat patients with scoliosis and kyphosis. So my pediatric work has taken me sort of all over the world. and. It's been probably one of the highlights of my, of my life for sure, particularly as I am able to get my family engaged in the process and honestly been able to get a lot of our patients engaged in the process. But I've gone anywhere from uh, Kenya uh, uh, in Nairobi where we did uh, some, actually I think we've done three, three or four different missions there, um, and more recently focusing predominantly our efforts in uh, Mexico where we've had sites in both Chihuahua and Monterey uh, setting up uh, spine deformity centers of excellence where we're training the local surgeons to be able to care for a very, very needy population. I'd like for patients to know uh, and their families to know that uh, really where my heart is. And uh, that's sometimes very difficult to communicate unless you really get to know somebody, you know. Uh, but my heart really is on seeing, seeing my patients not only receive the best care possible, but for them to have someone that they can rely on, someone that they can trust, and I think that element of a relationship is so critical. Um, outcomes are important, uh, patients doing well is really important, but I think that trust element to me is probably the most important of them all. And if I could emphasize anything when I'm with my patients, is it's, it's I want you to get to know me. And yeah, maybe we'll see each other a little bit more often at first just so we can have a relationship, but you know, I want you to trust who I am, my character, and my decision making, just like I want to be able to trust my patients that the care I'm trying to provide is also going to be carried out.